This is a new method to figure out if you have water in your oil. It's actually an old method. The new part is where you use your wife's coffee maker instead of a $300 hot plate. If you don't have full rain of your house, maybe you should get a used coffee maker at the thrift store and do this in the garage. Anyway, coffee makers hold a reasonable temperature that's over the boiling point of water, but low enough that it's not going to burn the oil. I measured this one to be around 240 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's try it on some new oil. Turn the coffee maker on, wait till it gets hot and stops gurgling. Now pour a little of the new oil on the plate and see what happens. Nothing. That means there is no dissolved water in the new oil. Kind of what you'd expect. Now let's try it on the gear oil that I just drained from my stern drive after being in the water all summer. As you can see here, the oil looks good, not cloudy or milky. Now drop a little onto the hot plate and see what happens. Look at that. Even though the oil looks good, it has dissolved water in it that boils out of the oil bubbling and crackling. In fact, you can have up to 0.02% water dissolved in the oil and not even be able to see it. Even more sometimes, depending on the temperature and the oil. So there you have it. An easy way to check to see if there's water in your oil. If you need more information on making your boat reliable, go to thereliableboat.com. There you'll find all kinds of articles and videos that will keep your boat above water and moving in the direction that you decide.